Uh, I'm Tarun Lala again. Uh, in case you're seeing this video for the first time, I've already, this is part three of uh, a video where I'm just kind of going through our designer fans. Um, the first video had the vintage collection. The second video had uh, the contemporary wooden collection. I'm going through the contemporary modern collection now. Very quickly for your information, this is a, this guy is our problem statement. This guy is our solution aesthetically and functionally a lot more superior. Um, this is our modern collection. This is a spelling mistake in here. This is our modern collection. And let me quickly walk you through it. Uh, meet Zen, a glossy white, beautiful fan for a larger bedroom, living area, so on and so forth. Of course, we've got a lot of functionality to these fans uh, because of which they're uh, beautiful and breezy. Uh, but this video is primarily for the look of it. So I will quickly go through Poppy with a very, very um, beautiful light. Uh, beautiful is a little less of the word. I think trippy is more of the word. Uh, the light that uh, is in the center of the Poppy. Uh, we have a dark night LED, white night LED that come without the LEDs as well. Beautiful collections to um, any bedroom or smaller home area very funky blade angle uh because of which it has really nice breeze but very very aesthetically appealing pieces when it comes to the modern design itself um marvel i i have to say uh i'm, I'm a big marvel fan uh and uh, coincidentally um we happened to uh, launch this fan the day after the great stan lee passed and so um, you know, we just named one of our fans uh, Marvel in uh, in memory of him. Um, if there's anybody watching this video and there is uh, a legal issue, uh, please do let us know. We'll be happy to change things. Of course, this was done out of respect. Magnolia, one of my most favorite fans. Um, not only does it come with our summer winter feature, it comes with a BLDC motor fan, comes with a remote control, and comes with a beautiful sleep feature. Now, if you've ever uh, slept under the fan and you, you turn on the fan, you feel that relief, but you know at times it's a little too much for you, so you, you reduce the speed, and then it's too less for you, so you increase the speed again, and you keep doing it until you find that sweet spot. Um, with the sleep feature uh, in Magnolia, and it's there in three, four other fans as well, uh, the sleep feature alternates the higher uh, speed and the lower speed. So you get a lovely breeze and then you reduce that and you get a slight relief from that, that uh, excessive breeze. And so the alternative higher and lower breeze is the sleep feature. And it's just a simple click of a button. This is the remote. The center button is the sleep button and it's an absolutely beautiful and luxurious experience to sleep under. The Shimmer is one of our latest models as well. Uh, it's a retractable blade fan like I mentioned in one of our previous videos. The retractable blades were first released for the dining table application where you had only one point and people wanted a lovely light feature but didn't want to miss out on the functionality of fan as well. Um, the retractable blades um, unfurl as soon as you turn them on. Until then, it's a lovely light feature. Uh, this comes with three colors of LEDs, uh, remote control, DC motor fan, and a Bluetooth speaker integrated right in the center. So you can take your phone, iPad, whatever device, connect through Bluetooth and play from whatever source you like. Melody is a smaller fan, 38 inches. It's great for kids' rooms and kitchens and so on and so forth. Melody was our original speaker integrated rock star. So it has a Bluetooth speaker integrated in the center housing of the fan. Polo is a very similar lookalike uh, of the Melody of people who just don't want the speaker. Uh, Papu, of course, you know, considering we're a, we're a luxury brand, um, we have a lot of fans with the names Mona Lisa, Venetian, Vatican, Picasso, Tiffany, and so on and so forth. But, um, um, well, at some point I'm not surprised, but it's the Papus and Chotus that people remember and take away with them. Uh, the Papus is great for walk-in wardrobes, kitchens, bathrooms, puja rooms, any, any small place. It's 24 
actually this may be wrong it's a 26 inch blade fan penguin is another modern and uh, very cool looking fan for the very minimalist even scandinavian interiors Pluto is a very cool fan. It's a modern fan that comes with reversible blades. Uh, you can reverse the blades to make it look completely red if you'd like. Um, if not, it's a beautiful matte black blade with a glossy black housing. Uh, giving that little shine makes it really nice. Salsa is uh, the closest to simple, elegant and funky that we have. If you see the bottom view, it's a really, really nice fan with a beautiful breeze. Great for the bedrooms. I know a lot of times people like uh, the fancier stuff for outside the drawing rooms and living rooms and dining tables and so on and so forth. Uh, but they want the simpler stuff for the bedroom. So salsa is what starts that category. Swing falls in the same category as well. DC motor fan. Turbine is also a beautiful fan, 52 inches, so just a few inches bigger. Uh, the big housing in the middle makes it look... Um, uh, makes it look very grand. It looks beautiful. Now, I want to introduce a brand new range uh, which falls in the modern collection. Um, this one is called the Jumble. Now, of course, when I explain the retractable blades and why they came, the Jumble comes not only with the application of dining tables, but also beautiful minimalist Scandinavian interiors uh, where the blades of the fan don't come out. The blades are inside, they're translucent, so, um, I mean, you can see them, but they don't, you can't exactly notice, notice them. And so, it comes with a beautiful LED ring around, um, uh, DC motor fan, remote controlled, and of course, the jumble is not alone. We have a different design called Newton, and another beautiful design called the Windflower is what you will see on this main page over here. It's absolutely beautiful. Very popular residentially, very popular for restaurants and so on and so forth. Meets Divine. Divine has a nice halo ring around it. Uh, when you don't turn on the, f the light at the bottom and only have the halo ring on when the fan goes on, it, uh, the reflection of the blades make it look like an eclipse. It's absolutely beautiful and the breeze uh, experience is absolutely extraordinary. Now Avalon works on the same principles as your HVLS fans. If you've ever walked into large warehouses or you've walked into an airport where you've seen massive fans up on the roof which go extremely slow but are extremely effective as well. It's the same principle, the high velocity, low speed that Avalon works on. Um, it's not as slow though, it goes up to 200 RPM, but it displaces about 14,118 CFM, which is absolutely extraordinary. To give you a reference point, uh, you need between six to 8,000 CFM for roughly a 450 square feet space. Um, and we're talking about double that amount in the Avalon. It's a 66 inch beauty, comes in a beautiful white and a beautiful silver color as well. Now the Metallica and the steel, very similar to one another. The Metallica comes with the light, steel doesn't. Um, fits a lot of these new homes that are coming up with their um, uncemented look. I forget exactly what that's called in the interior world. Uh, but, uh, you know, a lot of the walls are coming to be unfinished looks, the non-painted sort of looks, uh, which is going very, very well with pastel uh, color furniture and so on and so forth. Um, the fans like Metallica and Steel um, are, are going very well in those looks. Um, we used to have a nice fan called Metal as well. We don't have that anymore. I do have it in my room over here though which is nice. Um, moving on to something called the Wave White. It's a beautiful twisty ABS blade uh, finish with an LED in the center. We have the same version in a Danish tea color as well in the Wave Brown. And um, we have it in a beautiful greeny finish in the Wave Plus as well. Unfortunately, the pictures don't do any justice to it. So 
Um, I guess once the, the virus blows over, I'm going to take this and shoot more videos in the showroom itself in front of the real life fans. It'll be a lot more beautiful. Um, meet Shadow. Shadow is a beautiful uh, fandelier, uh, sh what we call fan and chandelier, that, um, that centrifugally opens up the blades when it's turned on. It's absolutely beautiful. There's a lovely wow factor to it and it just never gets old. The Nebula is something new and something cool. Now in retractable blade fans, you can see uh, the, the blades folded in uh, when you're standing around and actually looking for them. Um, but the Nebula is something that's completely closed. The Nebula and Odyssey are very similar. The fan is closed like this. And when you turn on the fan, it opens up. It um, at the depth of it opens and then the blades kind of shoot out of it. The Venus is a beautiful um, matte finished um, retractable uh, modern fan. Uh, it's great. Even the Venus Plus is great for above really nice dining tables or really nice uh, in bedrooms or living rooms and a lot of new apartment styles that are coming to really like these fans. Neptune is a different design, very similar as well. So is the Saturn. Bolt is a very funky fan because the blades can actually be shifted up and down over here. I'm going to use this pen because I want to try out some features of this app. Uh, but this, you can change the fan starting here to here. Similarly over here, similarly over here. And basically the vortex it creates from down here to up here are a little different um, and you can even alternate and have a double vortex as well it's definitely cool um, as a fan um, but it's not a very reusable use case to be honest the twins is a beautiful double height ceiling natural wood fan this is made up of a wood called Laonia and um, it's great for villa properties, double height ceilings, bungalows, uh, comes in a wall mounted version as well, the twins wall mount. But uh, for, for the wall mount, I will make a separate video. Thank you for watching.